season right now and before you explore the outdoors there are some safety precautions to keep in mind. News Watch 12's Ellie Skelly is here to explain how you can be prepared. Ellie? Yes, hi Jessica and Dan. That's right. You know, I'm definitely not an expert camper, not really the most outdoorsy person, and I wanted to know what someone like me might need to know before heading out to the wild. So if you're a newbie or you're a veteran in need of a refresh, here's what the experts say are the essentials to remember. Spending time outdoors where it's quiet and you're disconnected from, you know, the wired world. For Sarah and, Pearson, you know, camping is an essential on, part you know, of the Northwoods experience. It's the reason why she started working for the Department of Natural Resources. And it's why she wants to make sure camping is a safe and fun experience for everyone. Especially in the Wisconsin State Park System, our campgrounds are very safe. We have the conservation wardens that patrol the campgrounds, very safe. Um, campers look out for one another. We don't have much for incidents, but um, just be aware as you're out there and any uh, emergency situation, dial 911. To prepare for these worst case scenarios, there are certain steps every camper should take. Camping precautions would be definitely letting someone know where you're going, like your destination, the route. Um, just give them a time frame when you'll be back. Another one is bring water or extra food. If you get out and realize you're unprepared, there's no shame in turning around and trying again. You could always come back tomorrow. Um, being, being able to pack your trip in early just for the sake of being uh, overly cautious as well. And while there certainly are some risks to keep in mind, camping out here in the Northwoods makes it all worth it. Just in, in this part of the state, over 1,500 lakes, and you can have a lake to yourself. Um, the trees are magnificent, the towering pines, um, and it's, it's less populated. And just to underline what I learned in this whole process, before you hit the road, make sure you have a calorie dense food, a tent and stakes, weather gear, sturdy shoes, bug spray, and of course, a compass. And Dana Jessica, trust me when I say I am definitely well on my way to embracing the outdoors. Great tips, thank you, Ellie.